Hello everybody, Alex here from Snake Early Exotics and we won't be doing anything on the fish anymore, it's just reptiles for a bit. So uh, we're going to jump on my side, it's going to be a bit different for a while, um, but uh, hopefully I can fill you in on what's going on because it's mental. Um, but we're going to carry on as normal, just with my side, uh, and I'll see you in a bit. What we're going to do, we're going to have a look at the green animals because they've settled in now and everybody's green, so we're doing really well. So there we go, Meg's getting their food ready as we speak, so the problem is I can't remember which is the boy and which is the girls. I think the gills are a little bit bigger than the boy. I think the boy's just gone round the back. I've lost him. I've lost him. He's done a runner. He's done a runner and we've lost him. There is three, I promise. I've just seen him. But we can only see two at the moment. Oh no, there he is. Got one, two, right at the back, and three. Hmm. So everybody's accounted for. Everybody's nice and green. So I am happy as Larry. I think Meg's got some food. Good old Mego, picking up the slack as always. So I'll zoom in, there we go. Waterfalls go, we need to push this up. Yeah, full push that back a little bit. There we go. Buggies, bug, 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 bugs. Hopefully they'll just jump out onto the leaf. We'll have to tip it just a little bit, Mego. There we go, they're coming out, they're coming out. Woo! We got bugs, we got bugs, we got bugs, we got bugs. Loads of buggies. So we leave them to eat now and then hopefully they get a good munch. Hello little mate, how are you doing? So he was right down on the bottom he was, so I just picked him up off the bottom. What are you doing at the bottom? Hey? You searching for some buggies? Do you want me and Mego to put some buggies for you? How's that sound, eh? Come on, focus for me. No? We don't need focus, do we? Ah, uh, well, we don't need focus. He's doing really well. He actually, I was expecting him to go really dark once I picked him up, but he ain't. He stayed nice and green. He's chilled out. I think Meg's going to try and feed him off my hand. Oh, he's off. No, he doesn't want a locust. So Meg's going to grab the locust. And then Meg's going to open the cage because she's so nice. Yeah. Then we're going to release, release him back in. No, 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 no Mr. Chameleon, that's wrong. That's wrong, Mr. Chameleon. Where's he going? Mr. Chameleon, that's wrong, please, sir. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I'm sorry, off you go. He's like, that dirty human has contaminated me. Oh, I've got to have a wash now and wash all the dirty human off me. Oh, I don't know. So put some bugs in for him, but he doesn't like it because I'm here at the moment. He's very anti-Alex. But he stayed nice and green, so we'll leave him to it. Oh, what a lovely bloke. And this one is hiding in the bush, as always. Sir Bush a lot, I should call him or a bush wookie. Have a little look at the striped leopard gecko. So he's really popping with his colors now. So uh, we have a good look at him and he's very food orientated. So anytime there's food, that's it. He is on it and he's gonna eat the lot. So you have to be very careful not to overfeed him. Um, so we make getting all ready for me now. I'm gonna jump in and have a look at him. Mate, do you wanna come out? You can come out. Come on then. You're gonna bite me. Usually bites me, he does. You want to come out and have some food? So if we look at his back, look at his colours. So there's orange, there's yellow, there's purple, there's black, there's white, there's brown, there's caramel. <laughs> caramel. He's every colour under the sun, he is. Every colour. He's got no green, though. You've got no green, you're slacking. Where's your green and your blue? Slacking. Ooh, what's that? What yeah. It's a locust. <laughs> Loves his food. Not sure if it's a boy or a girl though. Might be a girly. Because we don't see any lumps down there. Yeah. She loves her food. 
with, a, with a, a gecko this size, you would quite easily see the lumps at the base of his tail, which would uh, which most males have. The two lumps. So I'm sure someone can tell you what those are. If you don't know what the two lumps are, Another one. Arr, arr, arr. If you look, they don't have the same ears as us. They just have a hole. And right in there, that little bit of skin, that's their eardrum. So that they don't have half the ear that we have and all the turns and all that. They've just got straight hole in the head. Hole in the head. A proper little hole in their head. You almost in your brain. You almost in your brain. I don't know. Such lovely pattern. I mean, look at that crazy pattern. You're lovely, ain't you, mate? Absolutely lovely. Also, going to have a look at is we're going to check on the European eyed lizard that we upgraded to his new tank. So he was in the hospital tank, if you remember. We took him because he's had he was attacked by the older male which we thought was female at the time if you don't know what's going on go back to my other video where i told you exactly the full story of what happened to him so um we've got the adult male up here no not adult male the bigger male up here and we've got the little one down here who was attacked so um, we took them all out of his hospital tank he uh, was doing absolutely fantastic and then so we've upgraded him back up to a tank with substrate so we're going to make sure he's settling in He's chilling out, he's not dehydrated or anything, he's getting the water and we've got to give him a feed as well. Let's have a look at the little bad boy then. I believe his skin is almost getting scales back. How's it look mate, you're getting some scales? See if Meg wants to feed you. Oh, we might need a small, medium locust, you might, because you are very tiny compared to the large ones. Think you're gonna bosh a large one? <laughs> they are quite ferocious lizards. So we can get a proper look at his back for you. Now he's in the light. Now he's gonna move again. He doesn't like it. He's like, no, you can't look at me. You can't look at me. And it's on the other side. Yeah. He knows. He knows. He knows. So you stay still, please. Please, there we go, stay over there. We can zoom in on you there. There we go. Andrew's healing. You can see he's getting his little scales back. Slowly getting little scales back. He's just a bit wrinkly. I think he needs a little bit of a bath and a little bit of a drink. So he's got water in here, as we can see. Well, I think we need to do some spraying of the humidity because it looks a little bit dry for him. So that's what we're going to do now. Hello, little mate. How are you doing? Oh, right, blooming out. We've got to clean your glass. You've gone mental yesterday. Oh, me doody. You have gone absolutely dear lady tap on this glass, haven't you, mate? Oh, proper cleaning job tomorrow. It's a bit late now in the day. Well, it's actually, it's the shop's closed now. I've finished. Oh, look at that lovely lizard. Lovely lizard. It's a lot of a shorter video today. Hopefully soon I can let you know what's going on. You won't believe what's going on, but I uh, can't say a word. So won't be saying anything. So we're just gonna carry on, just tick along as normal for now. But at the moment, it's all up in the air. So uh, please like, subscribe, comment, and share for me. If you wanna watch another video, should be a little box there. If you wanna watch a playlist, it lives at the top. If you want to subscribe to the channel, she's up there. So don't worry about nothing, nothing bad, but you wait till you hear this. I'll see you in the future. Bye.